Hello, welcome, dear spiritual friends. Thank you for being with me. My name is Cindy St. Martin, and I am a certified angel therapist and holistic healer and Reiki master for the mind, body, spirit, and soul. And you're joining me for my weekly angel card reading <laughs> uh, for the week of February 28th, 2016. So February is like, poof, gone. <laughs> It went by so quickly as knew all the months and we begin a new month of March. And so I hope you welcome it with open arms like I do. It's the month of spring and we our clocks move forward and time for changing and blooming and blossoming and rebirth and all wonderful, wonderful things. And for all my Christian friends who will be celebrating um, Easter. <laughs> So, okay, so I am going to select one card from three different decks and then a prayer card from Archangel Michael. And because of a law of attraction, power of intention, <laughs> I cannot select the wrong card. I had already called upon God, the Ascendant Masters, the Angels and Archangels to be with me. So I'm going to begin our reading for this week. I'm going to use the Gateway cards. And we'll shuffle and we'll see what our first card for the week is. I hope you had a wonderful, wonderful week and that you've seen all your blessings and you show lots of gratitude because that brings more blessings <laughs> and more things to be grateful for. And it's always the little things to be grateful for, things that we take maybe overlook every day, you know, being able to see and have food in our homes and to have a home and clothes and a job. <laughs> and the ability to stay positive. And also be grateful that God is inside of you. And that you have the power to manifest all that you desire. Okay, I'm going to cut the deck. We'll see what our first card for the week is. Igniting Courage. And the card reads, I am strong, valiant, and courageous. Whatever you put after I am, you become. So be careful with I am. I am is also the words for God. Um, so be very careful what you say. So you want to ignite courage. You want to be brave. You want to be fearless. So you can say, I am strong. <laughs> I am valiant and I am courageous. If we say I am sick, then you're right. If you say I am poor, then you're right. Okay. Uh, I am sad. You're right. I am lonely. You're right. We build off those energies that we put out. But when you say, I am healthy, you know, I am wise, I am wealthy, I am prosperous. And when we say these things, I am content, then they develop. The universe responds. God responds. We see our blessings and we become um, happier and um uh, able to uh, manifest exactly what we want. So igniting courage. Be courageous this week. Say it. Say that affirmation. Know it and believe it. And be careful what you say after I am. Be very aware of that. Okay. And awareness of what we think, say, and do is the beginning of changes that we can make to become better and better and better and stronger. And wiser. So I'm shuffling um, the love cards and we'll see what the love angels have to say for us. The whispers of love cards. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to cut the deck. And the card is 
I love you. These are very important words. So important things need to be expressed. They need to be said. So saying I love you to someone, um, even to yourself, that you love yourself and love others to be able to express. Maybe this is the, the, the part we need to be courageous about, to admit love. And to, you know, some people find it very uncomfortable to say that. But it's a gift from God and one we should open, be very proud to use. A lot of people say, love you, <laughs> which is great. It's wonderful. But when you say, I love you, it's more intense. It's more powerful. So look at yourself in the mirror and say, I love you. I'm going to take care of you. You know, I'm going to be careful what I say after I am. You know, you can say, I am lovable. I am loving. I am healthy. I am amazing. I am powerful. I am God. You can say these things because God's inside of you. And you can say that. And to recognize that God's inside of you makes you uh, amazingly wonderful. So saying I love you, very powerful. You can all say love you. <laughs> you know, that's great. That's sending love out. But remember, when you say I love you, something really powerful so it's saying we need to express that and show that love so the next cards are the angel tarot cards and we'll see what our third card for the week is so far very nice cards courage and love okay <laughs> I'm, sh I'm like the wild sh shuffler today <laughs> so this card came flipping out. It's Archangel Gabriel, and she is the Empress card. <laughs> the card reads, lavish abundance. Give birth to your dreams. Nurture yourself and others. There is the nurturing part. I love you. Telling yourself I love you. Having that, being courageous. Saying I am what you watch after that, what you say after that. You can say I am abundant. <laughs> you know, Give birth to your dreams. You have that power inside of you. You can create exactly what you want. You just have to have confidence and have courage to do that. Nurture yourself and others. I love you. Nurture that. And you're going to see things grow in so many ways. Don't be afraid to say it. Just say it. <laughs> you might shock some people. <laughs> That's kind of fun, too. <laughs> But to, to express it and to say it. And we and to give love, of course, the highest energy of all is an amazing thing. And But you have to also receive it. So three really, really good cards, I think, for a great week to start March. <laughs> As it marches in. And we'll see now what our prayer card for the week from Archangel Michael. Okay, I'm going to cut the deck. Ask Archangel Michael to help you with this situation. Archangel Michael is God's biggest and most powerful angel. And not only is he an archangel, he's also a saint. So he has these amazing, power, powerful things. And he can fix and just about do anything you want <laughs> and help you along with that, with his mighty sword. <laughs> and the prayer reads, Archangel Michael, thank you for assisting me with this situation. Please help me be filled with faith and peace at all times. Great card, situation, love, courage, abundance, Archangel Michael. <laughs> Can't get any better than that. So thank you all for being with me. I am so grateful for you watching and sharing my videos with others that I feel extremely blessed by it. And you in return are also likewise blessed. I invite you to visit me at my website at cindyshealing.com. There you'll see all the services that I provide. And hopefully you'll be um, 
uh, interested in having a session with me and I would certainly be delighted it's affordable pick the price that's in your budget budget and we can connect uh, either through Skype or on the phone or in person if you live close by spend an hour with me I will enlighten I will empower you I will give you the courage that you need and inspire you and you're going to see things so much differently and you're going to be able to manifest exactly what you want so I hope you would take advantage of that and of course on my website you can connect with me through my social media sites um, and then um, and also you can uh, join me every Wednesday night <laughs> I'm trying to gather my thoughts here <laughs> and so join me every Wednesday night I host the live web chat and you can get a free reading connect with other like-minded people if you're needing prayers or you're needing support you're going to get it you can also share your wisdom with maybe somebody else who needs support and love and encouragement it's a wonderful time it's in the middle of the week helps us get over the hump on a Wednesday night at 8 o'clock here on the East Coast. So I hope you can join me. So thank you again. And I send you lots of blessings and love for, the, uh, for a new week. <laughs> and starting March, may you be loved and blessed. And God bless you always. And remember, you're powerful when you're in the knowing. We have God, the Ascendant Masters, the angels and archangels behind you. They're powerful. There's no stopping you. So until next week, lots of love. Kisses me to you and of course I wish you all namaste bye bye see you later thank you for being with me <laughs>